finer properties in the neighbourhood without being too ostentatious. I'll say. Immaculately restored, as you'll see. <gasps> it's like 12 oaks. <laughs> Ashley, Ashley! There are seven bedrooms. How many? Seven. Oh, ho, ho. this big room is my... Frank listing where I don't give a damn. Uh, several living areas, a small ballroom. Uh, the old servants' quarters have been converted into a self-contained apartment. I can show you something smaller if you like. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Not all of us can be happy living in a cupboard. <laughs> no offence. The owners are hoping for a quick sale and are willing to sell the property fully furnished. <gasps> Mum, you've got to see this. Excuse me while I confer with my solicitor. The property comes with the furniture. And the beds too? Uh, for the right price. <sighs> Whoever said money can't buy happiness must have been a Rebecca. Neighbours won't know what hit them. Look out, there's a new dynasty in town. Hey, Mum, why do they see our new cars? Personalised number plates and all. Did I mention that the family across the street own the Australian division of Porsche? Do they have personalised number plates? Yes. Well, there'll be plenty of other noses we can rub our dosh in. Probably not the guy who lives next door. He's one of my clients, seventh richest man in Australia. Where are we on the chart? You're not. Mum, it'll be like living in the OC, but without the stupid accents. Yeah. What's the point in living somewhere where your filthy richness doesn't make people sick with jealousy? Mum, one word, this. Breeza, in Erinsborough, we're royalty. But here, we're just another face at the polo club. Ooh, polo club, I might meet Prince William. Now that we Timminses have made it, we can't just fade into the background like pot plants. It's our time to shine and stick it to all those who ever doubted us. Take us back to Ramsey Street. You drove. Then I shall take myself back. Come on, kids. 